What you guys got another video here for you in this one we're going to be taking a look at how we can delete or erase uh, data permanently uh, without using any third party tools now this one was requested on my forum and I thought it's a quick video so I'll quickly make this video now what it's going to do is not actually delete all the whole files on that drive it's going to delete the free space and that will stop people recovering uh, any data uh, from the free space area so we're going to take a look at two ways of doing this without using third party tools and I'll show you a little tool that you can also get off of Sys internal so let's get started anyway uh, so first off let me just show you what we've got here we've got a drive here on my computer here with some data in it and you can still wipe the free space on this drive uh, without uh, wiping all the data off on the actual drive itself but it will stop people from doing data recovery on this drive and pulling back any data that was previously on here so to do that uh, without using any third party apps which is built into Windows here we can use a tool so we're going to come down to the start button here now if you're on Windows 10 uh, you can right click on the start button and uh, run the command prompt as administrator on the Windows uh, 7 here we're just going to type CMD uh, here and then right click on the cmd.exe and run this as administrator say yes to the user account control this will open up a command prompt box now from here we need to put in our command now remember our drive was I so what we need to do is type in this command here forward slash and then W and then colon and then the actual name of the drive so we're going to do I for the drive and push enter and what this is going to do is wipe all the free space on that drive now this is only a four gigabyte drive so it won't take too long uh, but if you've got a massive drive it will take some time but it will uh, write different code to that drive and clear up the uh, free space so people can't recover any data on that drive I'll come back when this is completed so let's just take a quick look here at some of the commands that you can use and switches and you can see up the top here there's an array of them here you can put the path an extension and so on but you can see here uh, E encrypts uh, D decrypts and so on you just go right away through here and you see W uh, removes data on unused portions of the volume so you can see that's that command there and you work your way through and you can see what what's what here and uh, how you can use it so that's basically the commands that you can use for that let me just show you something else so another thing I wanted to show you was a third party tool that you can get from Sys internals and there's other ones out there as well that you can use this one's called sdelete and it's just a simple tool basically you can drop it anywhere on your hard drive from the desktop I've got mine in my C root directory I'll show you how this works and basically it's just going to clean the free space up on this drive here so it's not going to delete uh, files and anything like that it's just going to use it to clean the free space on that drive so let me just show you that S delete in action now what I've got here is I've already pulled out S delete into my root directory into my C root directory here and uh, you can see S delete 64 so what we need to do is open up a command prompt if you want to run this so what we need to do is open up our command prompt now if you're on Windows 10 again you can right click on the start button and run this as administrator we're going to type CMD in the start on Windows 7 right click and run this as administrator click yes to the user account control and this will open up our command prompt again and to access that program we need to be in our C root directory you can see we're in uh, system 32 so let's just quickly uh, change this back a couple of steps just like so now we're in our C root directory here and uh, what we want to do here is we want to run our command so all we need to do is uh, type in sdelete64 and then space and then what we want to do is we want to go to dash C which is what we was looking at previously and then we want to do I for our drive and then colon and this is our drive so this is going to clean that uh, free space push enter and again sys internals will bring up its license agreement and then you agree to this and again as you can see here it will start to run its passes on this drive now this again will take some time and uh, I'm just using a USB flash drive here so be patient just let it run its course um, if you want to do that 
but that is another way of cleaning up free space on that drive. So I'm going to cancel this out. Now I just want to show you one more thing. This is obviously using a third party tool, but it's C Cleaner. Uh, but again, these are much more easier. You don't have to use the command prompts. You come into options here, go up to settings here, and you will see some settings that you can tweak. Uh, but again, I must uh, warn you here that using these types of methods on drives will shorten the life of the drive because you're scrubbing the drive. And uh, so you need to be careful when you're doing this. Uh, but you can see here, secure deletion, uh, normal file, de file deletion is what is uh, by default. But if you want to do a secure file deletion, you can see here, this is what it's going to do. And you've got your passes here, uh, massive amount of passes. I mean, that is uh, will add time, a considerable amount of time for deleting all your, uh, you know, places where you've been visiting. And also for the free space side of things, so if you want to leave this on normal, uh, just oh, just before I go to there, I'll just look at the bottom here, wipe, wipe alternative uh, data streams and wipe cluster tips. And you can see here, if we come down to the free space option, you can then uh, be enabled to wipe the free space of that uh, drive here if you wanted to, and also uh, on here. So let's just do that there for a second so I can show you. I'm just going to select my drive here and uh, you can see wipe MFT free space and what you would do is then you would run this and it would run that on that drive but again it will take a considerable amount of time to run so that's why by default these are, are off uh, by default so anyway that's basically how you can clear up free space on your drive without using any third party tools and also I showed you a couple of third party tools just to uh, giving insight to what else you can use. Anyway, so I hope this one helps you out. My name is Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. If you enjoy these videos, guys, then hit the like button. Also hit the subscribe button if you want to keep up to date when I upload new videos. Also, if you haven't uh, joined my forums, then you can head over there and join my forums and post video requests just like this guy did. Or if you've got any computer problems or anything like that, we'll try our best to help you out over there. And if you haven't joined my Facebook fan page, the information is up on the screen. There is a little section on there that says reviews and you can add a little tiny bit of content uh, to show your appreciation and that does help get some visibility for me. Anyway, so thanks again for watching guys. Have a great weekend and I shall see you again in the next video. Bye for now.